are you talking about, Sarah? I'm talking about the other side of the story. Right, Talia? Sarah, I told you this in confidence. Yeah, but I think you told this is... her. She's angry and she's been drinking. I you think it's a good time to What exactly did, did Ray say well, to her? First of all, you know what? Friend. It's restricted information. <clears throat> Obviously, Officer Saeed here <gasps> got that. Thanks. <gasps> wow. Poppy? Are you mad at Talia? So that's what you think. You, you think you think I tried to frame Ray for murder? The... Wait a second. Yep. Why don't we just let yep. the, why don't we just let this go and eat wait, 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 and we have dinner and let this go? I'm being accused of murder and I'm just supposed to keep passing the sweet potatoes. Listen, you sir. shouldn't even be here. I was invited. I'm sorry, Vanessa. Sarah's just had a little too much to drink. Oh, really? Really? Is that what you think? Because I don't think I've had nearly enough. You know what? Sarah's mother came by this morning to tell her that she's leaving town. She's a little upset right now, Christian. Not to mention the fact, oh, Christian, that you no should have been there to be for her, up but you were You were not trying to do the right thing. Right? Right? Yeah. I want to miss more. I will not put up with this fighting. Not any day, but especially not, not this day. Dorian, you're kind of in that, um, place again. What place? Where you're driving everybody crazy. Yeah. Well, I'm just trying to make sure that everything is festive. I know. But you're you driving are. everybody crazy. Mm -hmm. I didn't get any sleep last night. I had to wake up Yvette, and we, by hand, washed every bit of crystal and stemware in this house. Well, that was very sweet, Hugh. But kind of crazy. What? I'm not supposed to say the word? I will get that. It's probably the delivery of the eclair and hand-dipped chocolate-covered strawberries I ordered. I hope you don't think that's excessive, Abby. Or crazy. Dorian. <sighs> It's you. Mm. Just when you need me. Sugar. Don't call me that. I know you're trying to get everyone through this day like everything's okay, but it isn't. This is a sad Thanksgiving. Well, I do have most of my family with me. Mm. Well, I think you need to work on that because they're not seeing Dorian. They're seeing some psycho Julia child who needs to cut back on her steroids. <sighs> I just don't want them to Let's know. See how sad you really are they know and they know that you love them so why not just order a pizza and be happy that you're all together happy thanksgiving dory happy thanksgiving now wait a minute where are the chocolate covered strawberries oh damn they were good <laughs> Hi, uh, Natalie told me to come over, so I said okay. Surprise, surprise. So that I could say to everyone that, look, I don't expect to be part of this family. And, uh, I know what I did to all of you, especially to you, Ray. So if you'd like me to leave, I will go. But if he leaves, I leave with him. Oh, that, that's the caterer, I hope. Excuse me. Is it always like this? Cool. Renee, the ball's in your court. Natalie, you can't go. Your father needs you, your brother needs you, your nephew. I don't want to go, but if Jared goes, I go. Stand by your man, huh? Yeah, kind of like you. Yes, but my man never did anything wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, darling, I'm so glad you're here. I'm so glad you're safe. Thank you. Thanks to Jared. He really took care of me. And I love him. And he is the luckiest man in the world. Right? Right. Good. Right. Good. You can stay. Okay. You know, you may not be a Buchanan, but you sure as hell behave like one. <laughs> you know, I didn't build this to drown you in nostalgia. I know that the past is the past, and, and 
and there's nothing that can change that. But I'm trying to learn from it. And, and last Thanksgiving gave me a glimpse of what life could be. And then I think life kind of caught up with both of us. Things got pretty screwed up. But I'm not giving up. And I guess I'm just hoping that you and I can find a way to start over. Hi, everybody. Um, I want to introduce to you our fabulous caterer, Lloyd, who baked our fabulous Thanksgiving dinner. Which unfortunately is still in the van, which slipped off the driveway and went into Ace's moat. But we got the glazed carrots. I'm really sorry. And uh, I'm sorry that your mother left. It's no excuse. I'm sorry, Vanessa. I'm sorry I ruined everyone's things. No, Meha, you haven't. I won't let you. So, I was going to tell you all this later, but I think this is perfectly timed. The new diner is finished, and the grand opening is going to be tomorrow. Tomorrow? I thought yes. it was going to be like... Charlie asked me if he could use it tonight so he could have a party, and he really wanted us all to come. So, I think it would be really nice if we all go over there and see the diner that your father built is still going on. And while we're at it, we can remember the fights that we had in that place and how they never changed how we felt about each other, just like now. I don't know what you're talking about, Mom. Nobody's fighting here. Everybody, I... I need to make a public amends. I'm afraid that I uh, got a little bit carried away today. No. You see, I, I started out just thinking about the... And then I started thinking about Todd, and I got so Dorian, angry. Dorian. And um, that was really wrong of me. Because I, I forgot to be grateful for having my family all together. Star, you especially, and Jack, and Blair, and Langston, and your newfound cousin, Lola, who's always welcome here in your house. Thank you. And we can't forget your handsome and loyal boyfriend. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> and, of course, my sister. I'm so glad you were here, and yes, I really do love your in-my-face, tell-it-like-you-see-it commentary. <laughs> I'm really, really grateful we're all together. And thank you, Dorian, for everything. Oh, thanks. You are so right. We've got to have mashed potatoes. <laughs> and then, dear, will you throw some potatoes on the stove? We'll do them, you know, peasant style, with the skins on it. I mean, the, rough. the duck actually looks pretty good. I uh, can't wait to eat it. Oh, sweetheart. <laughs> That's so nice of you. What was I thinking? Blair, why didn't you stop me? Me? Yeah. I mean, this meal sucks. Oh, it's not the big time. No, it's, it's, Come on. it's not what that. Dr. Dr. Lord. Dr. Lord. Dr. Lord. <laughs> <laughs> Mrs. Baker gave me my job back at the diner. Do you want me to call, see if she's still serving tonight? No. I'll call myself. Dory's a real piece of work, yes, isn't she? She is, Mama. But you know what? I saw my daughter smile again, and I didn't think I would see that. So yay for Dorian. <laughs> Happy Thanksgiving. Mm -hmm.